Picking up right where we left off last time, we've created, we've installed a MySQL server. We have created a database called Films by Chris. We created a table inside that database uh, called Users. And we've inserted information for five different users. You can see them on the screen right there. And we showed you how to display all the information using select asterisk from users to search through and display all fields from the users table. Uh, now we're going to show you how to narrow down your search fields. So just hitting up arrow, we can look again and we can see the last command, select asterisk from users. Uh, and if we hit space here, we can continue with this. We can say where, um, and we'll say L name equals, and we'll say Jones, and we'll and then we'll put the uh, other single quote there. Now when we hit enter, you can see it displayed all the information for everybody whose last name is Jones. So we have select, and then the asterisk means show everything from users, that's our table, where the last name, L name, equals Jones. Now we can do the same thing, we can do Akapinti. And if I could spell my last name right, that would help. An I there, we'll hit enter. And now you can see it's displaying everybody who has the last name Akapinti, which is me and my wife. Now let's say we just want to see the usernames for, um, for anyone who has the last name Akapinti. We can change this asterisk, because this asterisk here is what is being displayed. We can change that to be the field we can just type in user name and we'll hit enter and now you can see it got the same information both me and my wife but it's only displaying the username field so select username so select we're looking at just the username field from users that's our table and really you don't have to but it's proper and I should be doing this uh, basically the the commands uh, should be in capital. It just makes it easier to read. So select username, we're selecting the username from the users table where the last name equals Akapinti. We hit enter and it gives us that information. We can do the same thing for Jones. And there you can see it's displaying the information for uh, the usernames for both uh, Bob Jones and Tim Jones or Tom Jones? Well, you know how we can find out? We can change this to F name. So now it will display just the first names. So there you go, both Bob and Tom Jones. Um, we're gonna look into this a little bit more. I'm trying to keep these tutorials short, uh, but that is how you do a basic search and display certain fields uh, with MySQL. Uh, this is, I think, my third tutorial on this, and I've got a few more coming with some other basic stuff. Once again, uh, MySQL, I'm not that fluent in it. I just know how to do these basic things. Uh, I thank you for watching, and if you haven't watched the previous tutorials, give them a look. Hopefully, I'll remember to put some annotations up towards them, and I just hope that you have a great day.